protect your DNA. BioPQQ can promote formation of new mitochondria. InfoWarsStore.com Welcome to the InfoWars Nightly News. I'm your host, Jakari Jackson. It's August 3rd, 2015, and here's a look at our top stories. Tonight on the InfoWars Nightly News. Could the Democrats' next presidential candidate, Joe Biden, signal an intensifying drug war against the American population? Windows' latest release opens the door to the expanding spy state right under your nose. And Alex Jones continues his investigation into the falling European economy. I know you already know all this, but we need to get the word out to the general public because they're starting to wake up that there's a problem. They don't know what the solution is, and they're being sold that socialism and more collectivism and more wealth redistribution is the answer. Not understanding the ultra, ultra, ultra rich are tax exempt. All this and more on the InfoWars Nightly News. I began to get into iodine a few years ago because it was helping me and my family so much get healthy and detoxify. I believe our research is conclusive. This is the best iodine out there. And I know this for a fact, nobody else has got iodine based on these pure crystals, ladies and gentlemen. For a limited time, experience the ancient power of Survival Shield X2. Take advantage of this unprecedented 30% off super detox special at InfoWarsLife.com. Coming up later in our show, we'll have a special report from Alex Jones and also Rob Dew. They're over there in Europe. But first, let's talk about Prohibition. You guys have probably seen the old movies with the documentaries about the gangsters, the moonshiners, these guys cooking the bathtub brew, and then they go out in the streets and they have these big shootouts. It was a horrible, violent time in American history, and eventually, people decided that alcohol prohibition probably wasn't the best idea. But the thing about it is, so many years later, we have repeated the same cycle where you see people cooking meth in their bathtubs or in their basements, or you see these shootouts, these horrible gangland-style massacres in places like Chicago. It's pretty much the same thing that happened way back when, but now that we call it the drug war, it's something that we can't drop, and it continues to happen to this day. Now, should we legalize drugs across the board? I'm not telling anybody to go shoot up heroin or take meth or anything like that. But things such as marijuana, I wouldn't so much have an issue with. But now we have this article from Kurt Nimmo, Joe Biden, the drug war presidential candidate. According to Politico, Biden is a beloved figure in the Democratic Party, a stand-up guy, and the Democrats want him in the wings if for some reason Clinton implodes. Biden has enabled the disastrous drug war and played a key role in militarizing law enforcement including mandatory minimum sentences and the creation of a cabinet-level drug czar. So for all the reasons that I previous, previously mentioned, we have this huge, disastrous drug war. You know, when you talk about these guys uh, bringing in the cocaine and all this, and they want to lock up some guys like Rick Ross, who definitely was guilty, but it comes to common sense. Rick Ross wasn't born rich. He couldn't afford planes and trains and automobiles to bring all this cocaine in. So how did it get here? Nobody wants to talk about that. And they talk about, oh, you talk about Gary Webb, that conspiracy theorist. Regardless of what happened to a Gary Webb, and I definitely respect his reporting, if you don't trust a word that Gary Webb had to say, you can go see the 60-minute report where Mike Wallace was talking to the head of the DEA, and Mike Wallace said, hold on, you're telling me that the CIA brought cocaine to this country? And the DEA guy's like, yeah, I don't know any other way to tell you, Mike. This stuff is going on. It's continuing to happen in this country, and this is why they have to have these, or why they say to you that they need these MRAPs and the assault rifles and the riot gear and all this stuff. And yes, there is a time and place. There are situations where you may need 
ride gear where a standard cruiser or a, a van may not be sufficient. But to have this stuff across the board, it definitely is not necessary. And let's talk about things that aren't necessary in the spin cycle. Planned Parenthood. You guys have probably seen these several videos that have come out over the past few weeks. Uh, Planned Parenthood has a, or excuse me, the organization which is targeting Planned Parenthood has a total of nine videos. I think they're on video four or five right now. And in the most bizarre turn of events, just, uh, I just can't believe they're going this route. They're saying that Planned Parenthood actually prevents abortions now. And now we have the spin cycle. We have the tweets from Planned Parenthood Republicans. And they're talking about how Republicans hate abortion. And they're trying to destroy a government program that helps prevent over 345,000 abortions a year. And anybody with any common sense points out that an organization claims it is pre preventing abortions while executing almost 400,000 abortions in 2013. So I'm very curious of how they even got this number, this uh, 345,000 number, because how do you really know how many abortions you uh, prevented? I mean, does somebody who come in there and, you know, get a bag of condoms come by and say, hey, I would have had an abortion if, you know, you didn't give me that, uh, that bag of condoms. I'm not exactly sure how they tabulate this, but I think it's just another load of bull. They're trying to ban these videos in states like California saying that, you don't have a First Amendment right as a news organization to even present this to your viewing audience. It's completely ridiculous, and I uh, think that it's just a matter of time for Planned Parenthood. And when we're talking about a matter of time, it's time to fight for your privacy, because whether it's Edward Snowden or any other whistleblower, they're telling you that your privacy is at stake. And you may not care that, you know, people see your selfies or whatever until it's used against you in some type of way. And now we have Windows. They're spying on people in the headline, don't spy on me. How to opt out of Windows 10 intrusive defaults. Windows 10's pre-installed settings are privacy intrusive by default. We will access, disclose, and preserve personal data, including your content such as emails and other private messages, when we have a good faith belief that doing so is necessary, and that is according to the privacy statement. And they do have a few tips for trying to combat this. If you take a look at the article, it has a few tips on there. Disable sharing of your internet connection over Wi-Fi, as well as many other things. But it's not just on your devices, devices, your big computers and all this. It's also on your phone. And how to combat this, we have a From the Vault report from Joe Biggs. I'm Joe Biggs with Infowars.com. Now here at Infowars, we try to keep you, the viewer, and the people all around the world awake to the information going on. You know, over the past few years, Alex Jones has repeatedly told you and others here at InfoWars that the NSA is collecting your data. We have actual proof via my phone, my user agreement, where it says the NSA is taking my data and they're not responsible for any loss of data from my phone. This is mind blowing. I mean, like I said, we've known about it, but just to see it on your own personal phone that you went and bought at an AT&T store, just me buying this makes me agree to them spying on me. Just think about that. That's crazy. Not until you open up your own phone and put in your, uh, you know, your little password, you go to settings, and it's right there. I mean, I was just like, Wow. So it's not that hard. You put in your password, and then I don't know how it is for, uh, for Apple, but I have a Samsung Galaxy. All right, so you get your Android device, wherever your settings button is, click on that settings button. Go to general, scroll all the way down to the bottom to wherever it says about device. Then you're gonna go to legal information, open sources, licenses. Wait on that to load because there's quite a bit of information. You're going to go way down because that's how the NSA gets you. They want to hide the stuff way at the bottom. Okay, we're getting ready to come up on it. Here it is. All right, it's a system, lib4 slash libselinux.so. Now we'll click on that. It says, you, are, you agree that this software is a non-commercially developed program that may contain bugs and the NSA makes no and hereby expressly uh, disclaims all warranties. It also goes on to say that the NSA will not be liable for any loss of profits or loss of data. 
on your phone. Now what that is, is the NSA is using Linux to access your information on your phone. So this is something that they even have a Wikipedia about. It is the Linux SE NSA spying program type deal. It's been available since 2003. So pretty much every phone since 2003 has been a spying tool for these NSA agents. Just think about that. Every phone you've had since 2003, the things you've done, seen, talked about, pictures you've shared, pictures you've taken. No wonder these celebrity you know, nude pictures are coming up because they're just out there. Anyone can get it. They don't need to steal your phone anymore. That's, that's child's play. They can just go in through these bugs and it's right there. Proof. The NSA is spying on your phone. 2014 is 1984. Orwell was right. This handheld telescreen is spying on us right now and also giving us radiation while it sits in our pocket. So there you have it. I'm Joe Biggs with Infowars.com. Introducing Secret 12, the new InfoWars Life Vitamin B12 formulation. Now, InfoWarsLife.com is excited to announce that we can bring you our most bioactive, powerful form of B12 that has been developed with our exclusive perfected process. Secret 12 is a binary of nutramedical grade, bioavailable coenzyme forms of B12. Secure your revolutionary Secret 12 formula right now at InfoWarsLife.com or call 888-253-3139.